Hi everyone, it's Mary and I am here in my dining table. Um, I am working, uh, I should be in my craft room, I don't know why I want to do it out here, but <clears throat> I started here so this is where I'm working, but I am working on my daughter's 18th, it's her debutante birthday party, Filipinos, um, it's a cultural thing and we call it um, a debut. And so I'm working on her invitations. This is just a um, sort of a test one. So I've embossed the outer folder here. <coughs> and I added some punched lace and I used the Martha Stewart uh, punch. And then this is a sort of like the trifold uh, cards that I've made in the panels. So on here, I'm thinking about putting a baby picture of my daughter. And then, um, you, you, sorry, you open it up like this. And then here, it would have the invitation information. And then it'll open up like this. And then um, on this side here, I'm thinking about putting Velcro on this so that it, it opens up. But on the um, this section here, it's going to have... Uh, the uh, her friends that are doing the cotillion it's a dance that they do um, for the debut so the listing of all the people who are in her dance um, that they're doing and then this here I'm going to put down um, all the people who that are doing the roses and the candles and then uh, in the center um, I'm trying to debate on whether or not um, I'm going to put a photo of my daughter um, currently. So this one here will be the baby picture and this will be her um, basically almost 18 years old as a young lady. And her theme is a Paris theme and that's why I have the fleur de leaf. And um, yeah, so this is just the test invitation that I'm doing and um, <clears throat> I have been planning this party for quite a while now. So I bought these um, uh, pearls quite a while ago um, from Formosa Crafts and it was really, really reasonable. It was like, I think it was like six or seven dollars for this roll. And same thing with this. I have bought this and I brought it out because I thought it would go, but it doesn't. So I'll use it for something else. And you know, I'm just, I've got all these, um, the timeless, Teresa Collin paper, and um, I've had that for a while, and so, yeah, I'm just working on everything here. It's a mess, but that's what I'm up to. I'm liking how it looks, and then what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to cut slits in the back, and I'm going to put uh, some organza pink ribbon to tie here so that you can um, open up the invitation with a ribbon and then you'll do that so i think it's kind of cute i think it's going to turn out really well i probably have to make about 80 of these <laughs> so i can't be too elaborate but i can't i don't want it to be too simple either so this is uh what i've done so far we'll see if this is the end product or not but that's what i'm working with right now